I suppose what I'm most looking forward to out of this uh, week is speakers are going to rattle the cage a little bit and uh, send out some spiky messages. Well, it's uh, a real opportunity to look at advertising uh, on the other side of the ocean. Uh, we've always done it, of course, in New York. For hearing the European perspective is really quite interesting. Well, I think it's just a great opportunity for people to discuss the sort of nature of um, you know, advertising and cinema and long form um, format, storytelling and all that kind of stuff at the moment that we probably haven't had a debate about for uh, ever, really. So I was on a session with um, uh, Asif from uh, Senna and, uh, and uh, Ed from ha uh, Havas and it was just really interesting, a really interesting mix of people. So, you know, cinema, interactive media and an ad guy uh, just talking about cinema, which I thought was really interesting. I took a lot from it. What I value most about cinema advertising, I guess, is it's a mini movie. You know, there's a whole period from very, very young when I was a student, I used to look forward to seeing big cinema trailers because um, there's just something about the advertising when done on a big screen. It's, the sound is that much better, they look that much better, and so there's something epic, but all in this really short format. It's really, really amazing to um, appreciate cinema advertising when it's done well because uh, the audience is captive, and the screen is ginormous. So when um, commercial producers take the time to develop content for that screen, even in 30 or 60 seconds, you can have a pretty dramatic impact. So when it's done well and done right, it's amazing. I think the fact that you can't edit your experience in this day and age, everything's being edited. Everyone's editing their experiences. Everyone's deleting adverts or fast-forwarding adverts, even fast-forwarding through content. And with the cinema, you can't do that. It's a completely pure space, so therefore you have someone's attention um, and they're captivated. But they're also in the mindset of listening to a story. I think that's where the real power of cinema is. In the United States, uh, we, our advertising has been really uh, not really great. Uh, it's been uh, either a very short loop before the cinema starts, uh, just local, uh, newspaper, local restaurants or cafes or stuff, and then uh, occasionally a few pieces, but I'm not seeing the production value that I see in Europe. So I'm really interested to see how that's evolving here and how that may come to the United States. My media predictions for the year ahead, let's base them on some stats. I think this has been the best uh, admissions season for cinema since I'm going to say 1970, God knows, but it goes way, way back. And uh, I, I'm going to say that cinema is suddenly going to re-emerge as the dominant media. DCM Tuesdays, I think that it's interesting to be able to watch the film in that environment and it's a great networking opportunity plus listening to you guys kind of talk before the film with the producers or give us a round up of what's coming up in the year is really interesting. We've uh, got access to a, a great film kind of fresh off release which uh, is always nice to see. Great night out, you get to watch a film, you get to meet people in the industry, you have a couple of drinks before and after, and it's overall, it's just a great experience. It's better than going to a regular cinema. I really enjoyed Welcome to the Punch, actually. Um, I thought, so, I mean, really, really different. The, the um, Q&A at the beginning was, was incredibly useful, incredibly interesting. I, I love that kind of stuff. It's slightly more unusual, gives you a bit more insight, something your friends don't have, so it's kind of a, a pub moment that you can tell them about afterwards. And it gives you, gives you a bit more kind of collateral outside of, uh, outside of the cinema. The film looked amazing. The film looked like it cost a lot more than it did. It, it felt like a Hollywood movie. I thought Welcome to the Punch was awesome. <laughs> 